Hey guys, this is the Ottawa Sequence, and today we will be, I don't know, I guess we'll be rescuing Lil Lily and in the Aether Paradise, and last time we defeated Nanu to get our Darkium Z, Darkium Z, or Z Crystal for Dark type, and this time... We're in Aether Paradise, and yeah. And after this, I'm I guess we're going to Point Island. Aether Paradise is hard work. We made it this far, this far without running into trouble. But I don't like it how quiet it is. You two stay alert. But why will Lily be here at the Aether Paradise? She would just will be. Ah, this guy. Fine. So what are we gonna do? I guess we take the elevator. You guess? And we're following this guy? He doesn't have any plan. Oh, we can't. Okay, so, it would be so cool if we got to write Toros around. What is there? Okay, so we have to go that way. Well, we're gonna run into more trainer battles, I guess. I'm gonna, we're gonna try to avoid as much trainer battles as possible, so we get to the main thing. Well, I just hope we we get through all the Aether Paradise. So we got like not so much left on Ula Island, huh? Oh, so it's gonna. It's gonna dig, isn't it? Alright, so I'm guessing this will take it out. Okay, yeah, it will take it out. Never mind, I didn't correct it. This Captain does. I never heard of that move. It's either that or just. Yeah. Well, never mind. It's gonna be a useful move, anyways. And let's try to go into 45. Well, this dude just. This guy. Pack the two con two con or two cannon. Well, at least this two cannon's gonna run down. Our two cannons just like super stronger than this two cannon. Now, speaking of which, I just had to say that. But we're gonna get through this. Don't worry. Oh, caught me, damn it. Right. 
see how far we can get. So, I guess that's what they're gonna have, huh? Alright, so I'm gonna have to bring, I was gonna say fire out, but okay, let's try it worse. Let's see if Thunderfang does anything. Never mind. Fire is going to have to come out then. And there goes the high horsepower. Let's see if we can get a turn, but this will help. Our high horsepower. The ranches. All right. Tyson Delphoxen. Our Delphoxen. One more mystical fire should take it out. And it leveled up. Alright. So we're going to try to avoid more Ether Paradise. Well, you, if you guys want to fight them, we're going to... You go ahead. You guys go ahead. But hey, anyway, at least we found Rick Candy. Anyways, if you guys want to like fight all these, you guys can. But you don't guys have to. I'm just trying to avoid these so we can have stay more time. So let's just, you know, switch out and then finish this off. <laughs> Alright. So let's just use Mystical Fire again. And down goes Parasite. Oh, okay, so, alright, so we're gonna have to go with Luxray then. Or Luxray, she, she'll help us out. So that leaves us with Robin Hood to take this out. Even though only one hour Pokemon went down, that was our luxury. Oh. 
Oh, so one more. All right. I guess we're going for leaf leaf. Chalk is 39. Alright. So we're gonna have to revive and heal our Pokemon up. Well, it looks like we got everything, besides from that one trainer. Hmm, just like I thought. What were you doing there? Looks like outsiders can't use the main elevator to reach the lower levels. I was afraid this might happen. Still, what a pain. We don't have any choice. We all have to go up. I, Fab, I am the Aether Branch Chief, the only one in the world I'm irreplaceable, can we say that word right, and here you come back, uninvited, like you don't know why, you, all, you of all people should know everything that happens in Aether Paradise, isn't that right, hi and mighty Branch Chief? <laughs> Look at you, living in, living out in the world has it been kind, has it? I'm not, I'm still not telling you anything, and you, of all people, should understand why, Gladion. Hey, Harm Lager, you know why being a trainer is so great? Because you're battling it, you're, because you're battling, it doesn't matter if you're a kid or an adult. Everyone's an equal in Pokemon battle. Oh no, is that right? Is that what you think? So you wish to battle me? Branch Chief Faba? The man who has caught Aether's Paradise best no, Aether Paradise's last line of defense is to battle a mere child? Okay, so I guess we're battling Faba then. So we have lots of going on in Ether Paradise. Only Fab only has one Pokemon. Which Ether Paradise has like tough Pokemon. It's just like, you know, they're too hard. One more hit should do it. Come on. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you, Alexa. And Alexa got into 46. How, how can this be? How could this child? Uh, look at you, Arnlinger. Faba is real strong, too. And that was quick, by the way, too. It was one of the shortest and quickest battles that I ever fought in, sun, in Pokemon Sun and Moon and, and Ultra Sun and Moon. Well, that, to be honest, from my experience. But for us, this was the quickest battle out of the whole entire game. So, as I said, Fabio, you, you of all people know what I'm here for. Indeed. The world is truly has been kind to you, has it? Look how hard it has made you. 
If you're looking for Cosmo, I suppose they must be downstairs. Downstairs? Yes, Miss Wick said there was another elevator. What do you, what do, you do down there? Experiments to reach the world's different from the law. That's why I've been told yes. We're been hurry, Faba. A lift would be nice. Why not? This is it. This is an act of kindness I can do for you. Thanks for position as a branch chief. Iron Liger. How? Oh, if you're ready, let's head down. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. We're ready. All right, let's go. So we're going downstairs then. Smug look on his face. Everything looks the same, I guess. It only has been two years though. Wow, it's a secret hideout. Don't get too excited, Hal. Though I guess it's better than freezing from fear or nerves. So, where we go now? There's two loves two loves up ahead. I'll check the first lab, secret lab A. You two check the secret lab B. It's the second lab down the hall. Just focus out. Think you can do it. I think you can do it. Well, we can trust. We can't trust Faba. I'm sure he's already told half of the foundation all about us. You don't. You didn't even answer my question. I don't. I know what's it gotta be. Nerves, eh? I reckon that you're more afraid to be here than either of us, huh, Lady on Here, hurry. You take this. Okay, so at least we got another max to revive. Well, you must be scared right now. Let's go down and do this. I agree. Intruder spy will protect our secret lives. Hmm, if we use Prime Arena, we can try to take this down, but it's gonna, since this, this Pokemon Muk is poison type, either way, even in its original form is poison and low form is poison, we're gonna have to go with Fighter. Cause I, I think he's gonna be our best bet. And we're gonna have to heal up. And there goes Muck. And we're gonna have to heal up um, our. No, we're not gonna learn Feather Dance. 
and Delph wants to up to 44. We're gonna have to heal up fighters, so yeah. Looks like I'm next. I'll show the power. Okay, so I have to finish them three times. Okay. So let's go for Del Fox, I guess. Del Fox is gonna be our best best now. So I guess yeah. For many times, he is fire. That's not it. One, one KO shot though. Well, that's gonna take it down because many times since it's like steel, since steel are very like, you know, very weak to fire types, it can be easily taken out. But electric types are only weak against ground types, so you, your best bet's gonna be. A, Electric type is gonna be ground type. Unless it's just like Magneton or it has a secondary. I think a dark type can take a psychic kick out, you know. Hopefully we can get through. Polygon? Or Porygon? Is one of those Pokemon, like, you know. It's hard to take out, but you'll eventually take it out. One more should do it. Come on. And yes. We were doing experiments to try to find a way to open ultra wormholes using creature called Cosmo as the key. So what is now left to explore is a secret labs. It's not here. Don't even think about getting in here. Me and no, we're going to make it look like we might look. We're both what we were made to, meant to do. I, I was like an ornament to my mother, wearing whatever she told me to wear, acting wherever she wanted me to act. No was crafted just as carefully. It was made just to battle the beast. In this room, right here. And so we're going to have to go into another room. Which is, this is a lot. Yeah. I'm gonna say this is a la last live right here. Should be. What? What are you kids doing in here? Don't touch anything with your grimy hands. Grimy hands. This res this research is our life. I don't care if you're a kid or what. I'll send you flying if you throw in it.
And so dual battle is how evolves? You tell me. Okay, so he is evolved. And we're going to have to take the antidote to Fighter. Well, we're going to have to give Fighter an antidote. Wow, I didn't even have to do anything, but the, hey, at least that gave me an opportunity to heal up. Shell grew to level 40. I may have been an expert studying Pokemon, but no, I'm no expert when it comes to battling them. But the guys in Lab A next door, they're pretty experienced with battles. After all, they spent so long researching that uncontrollable Pokemon. Hey, focus people, Where, where's Lily and Cosmog? We may have lost them, but that doesn't matter, we're going to help you. That, that doesn't mean we're going to help you. I'm not telling you anything. She's not here, is she? Even you can see that. Come on, Harley. Let's split up and look around. Maybe we'll find some clue. Eat the, eat the report. Cosmog. Cosmog is hypnotized to be a type of ultra beast that hails from another dimension. Dimension named Ultra Space. When placed under significant stress, it reveals the power to create and open ultra wormholes. In order to escape from its suffering, we are now working on a device that will allow us to manipulate ultra wormholes and create when Cosmo is subjected to extreme stress. So, wait, Cosmo may be an ultra beast? We should, we should go tell Gladion about this. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna fall behind. You find anything? You learned about a bit about Cosmog. Like it might be an ultra beast or whatever. If you you stress a lot, if you stress it out a lot, it can create. Ultra wormhole, maybe run away or something. If it, if it's stressful, if you heard, if you heard it, it it is what you mean. Was that why she ran away with Cosmo? She always was too nice. But we didn't find any sign of it down here. Yeah, that would probably knew it would be de dead end. Darn. He did. He did. He outsmart us. Claudia never explains anything, huh? Probably thinks he. It makes him look cool. Should we go after him? We we all got into this together. Might as well see it to end together. So they outsmarted us. Oh, there's a Pokeball. 